Hey y'all. So, um, ooh, my neck. Ah, oh, I don't know if you guys can hear that, but okay. So I have a confession. I'm making a video. It's been a while. I haven't made a video, but I'm making a video because I, will, I I need to make um a confession, which is so um I don't have a gym. If you guys are wondering. But I do have a few people ask me which gym I go to. I don't exactly go to a specific gym because I don't have a gym. I'm sorry, I don't have a gym. <laughs> but then when you do see my, me posting up, me going to the gym, it's when I find time to go and I get hooked up to go. Or I, you know, that's how I get to go to the gym. So the reason why I don't have a gym is because I, I got kicked out for training people. And maybe they, the trainer got jealous that I'm probably still in the business. I don't know. But yeah, that's how. That's why I don't have a gym. So I don't have a gym for the past. Gosh, this is not supposed to be a, a gym video, but I'm sharing this with you so you guys kind of see where I'm going. So I have not been going to the gym for like almost. You know, I don't have a gym for like almost like a year now. And um, you know, I've been very very busy and very packed with helping other people getting back in shape. And you know, when you when you when you, when you focus so much on other things. Uh, you kind of forget to take care of yourself, right? So it was it was um, hard for me to keep up with myself and to um, I mean I was on you guys, but I was I wasn't as disciplined as I would like to be on myself. Because of that, I too went through this thing, you know, this yo-yo thing. And I share this with you because I feel that we all go through that, you know, we all go through that, and uh, I went through that and. Uh, I've been eating a lot of crap, been feeding myself fast foods, um, unhealthy food, um, unhealthy carbs, um, and the last, the last week, like I said, I gotta make a confession, right? <laughs> last week when I went out of town to help a few girls out, uh, we went to a cupcake um, shop, a cupcake shop, and I love sweets, okay? Love, love, love sweets. So I went to the cupcake shop and I ended up buying a chocolate ganache cupcakes and a caramel cupcake with some filling inside and I bought a brownie. So I spent six dollars on desserts, six dollars on crap pretty much, empty calories, you know just sugar pretty much feeding my, myself and I thought I was happy, you know this is good, this is awesome, so really honest, I wasn't happy. Because at the end of the day, I look myself in the mirror. I didn't like my bloatiness. I didn't like the nastiness I feel myself. My, you know, my stomach was kind of pudgy, and that's not me. You know, that's not me. And and I say that because you know, some of you guys out there might feel that way after family functions or or having like a, a cheat day for like a cheat week. You know, so that's how I felt. And I said, you know what, Nia? I, you know, I don't belong in that kind of body. I want to be healthy. I want to feel alive. I want to be happy. I want to feel fit and I want to look at my best because when I feel and I'm at my best, I do better in general and I feel great and I just have an awesome time and I want to feel that way. So because of that, last week, last week um, after that cheat meal the next day, I got onto this regimen that I created for myself, okay? I got onto this regimen that I created for myself and it's been like a week and oh my gosh, guys, I lost about five pounds in a week. Okay, I lost five pounds in a week, and um, here's the results. Here's some of you guys. So, um, yeah, I think I got shredded. Like, oh my god, like.